Reed? Yeah. Time to get up, dude. Cantori's gonna be here in like 20 minutes. Yeah, usually uh, I have to wake up Reed like three times uh, throughout the day. Um, this is only the first time. We'll see if he gets up and stays up or if I have to go back in and wake him up again in another 10 minutes. Reed, are you up? What? Are you up? Good save. You up? Code red. Sweet. Sweet. Where is he? Inside? Making breakfast, I hope? Is everybody here? Yeah. What? Dude, Cantori's outside. Are you serious? Let's go, get up, Jammer. That's uh sounded like Cantori, yeah. That's who it is. Did you hear did you know who that was? <laughs> I told you. like a helmet? No, it looks good. Oh, that's not what I've heard. You, weren't you going to get a haircut yesterday? Yeah, but I didn't. I storm chased. It looks, it's the nice, uh, it's like the perfect length right now. I mean, you could get it trimmed up. I think I should wear a hat. No, it's I'm fine. pretty sure I should wear a hat. Don't wear something like nasty trucker hat. Actually, I... Well, as soon as uh, Beautiful gets out of bed this morning, well, I'd like to meet him for the first time, so that's kind of fun. Um, but no, I, I mean, we're going to go out and chase. And, uh, you know, if you look up in the sky already, you can see we get good signs of instability already showing up. So it's going to be, you know, it's not perfect, but it's, I, think, I think we'll find something today. Yeah, was, I'm having a slight panic attack. It's kind of a hero of ours uh, since I was like five, seven. He's in better shape than uh, all of us combined, though. That's why I'm sweating right now, though, freaking out. I'm ready. I'm red dirt ready. <laughs> it's okay to sweat. Yeah, I don't yeah. seem it out. Come on, Jim already in the target area? <laughs> Actually, he was in the target area before you got up. How's it going? That's bad. Good to see ya. Thank you. <laughs> Check out the other side there. Happy birthday. Thanks, bro. Jim. Sir. Well, good morning, Sunshine. How you morning. doing? <laughs> nice of you to join us. <laughs> What's happening? Uh, I think it feels moist out here. Yeah, it does. Yeah. Nice to meet you. <laughs> good to meet you. Did I, did I wake you up or not? Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. We need, we need a little discipline around here, though. No, that's good. That's good. Well, we got a big day, you know. And, uh, and which, didn't take which one of these toys are we going in? I think we should do... Uh, whatever, whatever you want. Sure, we you should, should do... I think we should just both. Just take me around, man. I, you know, I yeah. haven't chased, you know. I'm not a, mm -hmm. I'm not a chaser. I'm, I'm an office rat, so... Yeah, you're, you're, see you're stuff a chaser on radar. more than anybody. Well, there are so many storms you've been on that I wanted to be on, but... Uh, yeah. 
It's, it's really a, an amazing experience to have Cantori with us here today. Uh, I've watched him since I was a little kid on the Weather Channel. Um, it's one of my heroes, so I'm really excited. Is Joel coming out? He says, yeah. We're yeah do tell Joel to come out and say hi to his old uh, Hawaii mate here. I mean, what's up with that? <laughs> I don't know. Is, is Joel okay? coming? He's a fair weather chaser now. Yeah. Okay, so again, I'm in this, right? Because I've already set up shop. Yeah, we're going to do uh, Dominator 2 today and then Dominator 3 tomorrow. Because I think uh, I just feel at home. and I spend more Dude. time in that vehicle than my own home. Don't even don't second guess it. Let's do it. All right. Good luck All right. We're, we're going to get something today. What it is, I have no idea at this point. But uh, whether we're in this thing or that thing, it's going to be a good day. It's always a good day when you chase, even if it's in a Subaru. Hey, it's great to have you in the vehicle, by the way. Thank you. Yeah. It's great to be here. Dude, seriously, I've always wanted to do this. And it's like, no, 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 you can't do that because that takes away from, from Justin and Simon. And I'm like, no, it doesn't. Yeah. It would have helped, probably. I mean, uh, we all could have been like exactly. two teams and exactly. stuff. But yeah. They finally are up for it, so here we are. It's a dream come true. <laughs> yeah. I'm ready to go with you guys. If we miss a tornado today, we have no excuses. Zero. Like, normally, I'll blame Dick, he'll blame me. But in this case, <laughs> in, this, in this case, you'll blame me, right? Because <laughs> let's blame that guy. He hasn't been here before. He can take it. Yo, bro. Oh wow! Nice. Now yeah, we're good to go. This is good. It's 62. Yeah. So you're a sweat. So you're a sweater. I didn't realize you were such a sweater. Oh yeah. Big, big time sweater. <laughs> That's good, man. That's good. Sweat all that poison out of you. That's good. Man. I'm definitely a sweater, always have been. Uh, we sweat out all the impurities, the gas station food that we eat, the preservatives, uh, energy drinks. But I think uh, I think Jim also might be motivation for us to get healthy. He gave me one of his vitamins, <laughs> live vitamins. Well, that's what's making you sweat, right? Is that it? <laughs> yeah, man. Yeah, you got to stay healthy on the road. It's huge. If I'm given the chance and there's a tornado, I'm driving into it. I hope you're ready. Oh my God, I'm so ready for it. I, want, I expect action from you guys. Action. He's more ready for it than anyone. I was thinking about putting a why do you, Why do you think I, I said years ago, I want to chase with Timmer? He gets results. <laughs> yeah, on this one. This one just, I mean, look how circular that is too. This is this boundary right here. Nice lightning. We're in the target area. I just need a little help from Mother Nature. All right, we got one. That's a rope. <laughs> oh, it's got a uh, stronger rotation on it now. It's moving due east. Got a nice high base right now to, uh, to our west, northwest. Got a little bit of a hail core here. It's just starting to get, just starting to develop. Uh, we've already got a storm firing like right here, so. Yeah, this just smells like the plains, man. And then you start seeing rain shafts and whale's mouths, and you're like, wow. Yeah, 33s. Hey, try these guys. Wasabi and soy sauce. Oh, I love those. Dig in. Yeah. I love the wasabi. Wow. Wow. Isn't that rocky world? Woo. Dude, did you get did you get a sandwich at the subway? Yeah. That was a good play. Thanks for telling me to do the same thing. Yeah, try some of those Triscuit. These are the uh, tomato and sweet basil. Oh, wow. Crunch on a couple of those babies. Where's that left split base? Man, look at those blobs. That's weird how these northern ones are croaking, though. So I, whatever they're doing, they're going to do it fast, and then that's it. I thought we had a chance because it was moving again, you know what I mean? Yeah. It's not going to sit there and choke on its own rain cool yeah. air, but... The animals always look good when they have no tower underneath. That's pretty modest right above it. That's how storm chasing goes. Looks like all these are dying to the south. Yeah, let's go look. Beautiful anvil out here, though. Well, we're done. You can be on it pretty easy. It could be that it'll probably root. It looks like it was trying for a while, then it kind of died out again. Two. 
Hey guys, I'm here with Reed Timmer from TVN, and you know, as, as chase days go, Reed, we came up a little on the empty side today. We did, but you've got to be used to it as a chaser, because busts right. happen more than you see something, and at least we saw storms today. We did, and, and on radar for a while, they looked good, they had hooks. We saw, you know, some rotation. We saw some hail certainly reported with these storms, but they just didn't last that long. Yeah, this is definitely unusual, and we're shooting for the record in Oklahoma, I believe, for a record low right. for tornadoes. So not only are we going to see the change in the weather tomorrow when we get some tornadoes, but we're also going to be in the Dominator 3. Yeah, the Dominator this 3 is going to be ready. This is the Mercedes-Benz of Chase vehicles. It is, and it has AC, which is great. But uh, it can, it can, it's bigger, stronger, faster, can withstand stronger tornadoes. It's got the spike system, airbag hydraulics, and we'll be in the beast tomorrow. We're going right. to need it. One more question. Who's going to get more excited when we see the tornado? Reed or me? It's going to be a toss-up, I think. What do you think? I think, uh, I think I'll hit a higher octave for sure. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Until right. tomorrow. Fun. All right. Back to you. Tornado in Illinois today. That's in Illinois. Well, we were in the wrong place at the wrong time. But sometimes you get those mesoscale accidents like that up there. I'm getting hosed over here. <laughs> uh, so, you know, last couple of days, you know, we, we tried to make uh, a cake out of uh, eggshells and water. It just doesn't work that way. You need we need a lot of ingredients, and we just didn't have that. Uh, it's been a pleasure chasing with this guy and his crew. I mean, I feel like family. And they treated me like family, and I appreciate that. It's been a great, great couple of days. I gotta come back, man. I gotta come back. Just come back for it. Yeah, ten days. It's gonna yeah, be crazy. May twentieth. I'll come back. All right, about May twentieth. Thank you, Tom. We give you the retimer guarantee. We are gonna intercept. I didn't say what. How'd you get into weather? Have you always been? My dad. My dad. He just says to me one night, or I was sitting at my dining room table. He goes, what are you going to do with the rest of your life? I said, I don't know, Dad. I'd be, be a fireman, electrician, you know. He goes, he goes, why don't you go study the weather? You're like, a, you're like a freak when it snows. You leave the barn light on. You go out. You wait for the first flakes. You go shovel the walkway so your mother can go to work. You need to go study the weather. He goes, if you wake up for the next 50 years of your life and you have to go to work, you better love what you do. Wow. That is a true story, man. Oh, this is perfect, actually. We got a chance to debut the Dominator 3. Mm -hmm. yeah. Did it dominate or did it leak? It, it dominated and it leaked, but it's not a Dominator <laughs> if it doesn't leak. So. That's right, you said that, you said that. So the May drought for tornadoes continues. Yeah, the major I mean, drought continues, and but eventually this which pattern Which is fine, by the way, which is fine. I know a lot of people say, you want tornadoes? Are you kidding me? But uh, mm -hmm. it is fine, and you're right. The pattern may turn around, and the fact that I didn't get to see it or intercept the tornado with you means I'll be back. Yeah. So thanks for a great couple of days, buddy. Thank you. Reynolds. Yeah, let's, get, let's get him to do okay. a freeze frame. You ready? Right. <laughs> That's a wrap. Yeah, Reed's always late. We were supposed to be here about 20 minutes ago. He still hadn't showed up. I'm actually going to text him. See where he's at. Nope. Nope. Gizmo. Uh-uh. Stay. Okay, you want to go? All right, come on. Come here. Let's go for a ride. Gizmo, stay. Come. It's a well-trained dog. Heading out to uh, kind of a Cestrals goals for storm chasing this year. I'm coming, Gizmo. Uh, we were supposed to be here at 2, and I was on time. It's now 2.56, and Reed's still nowhere to be found. So I texted him, haven't heard back anything yet. Joel isn't quite as passionate about you know, the storms and storm chasing, and just Joel likes to kind of have a, a bird's nest, I think. And uh, when he gets you know, far away from home, he starts freaking out. 
I love storm chasing itself. I mean, I look forward to spring every year. But when you add everything else that, that's kind of happened the last few years on top of that, um, you know, if everything went smoothly, that would be one thing, but it's never that way. There's always issues, there's always something coming up, and it really detracts from, you know, the main goal of being out there, the main reason to be out there, which is just to see amazing storms. And I think that's, I mean, that's one of the, my biggest issues with, with chasing with Reed all the time is, uh, it, you know, the, this thing that I love to do uh, becomes all about this drama about everything else and not necessarily just getting out there and seeing the power behind Mother Nature. We got big problems. We're going the wrong way right now. Okay, take up a few spots. A little worried someone's gonna dent the exterior. <laughs> oh, we're okay. They still hit far, even if they have scratches. Yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't need too many to beat this guy. <laughs> Joel, stay. Hey Joel, I've got one ball, that's all I should need, right? I've only got, I don't have any. This place must not get much business, it's pretty hard to find. All right, <laughs> I'll go grab some balls for us. Watch Gizmo. Gizmo, come here. Don't be afraid, Gizmo. Hey Gizmo. Gizmo, Gizmo. Where in the hell? Come here. Gizmo, come here. Someone steal Gizmo? Gizmo! I purchased these, the uh, Pinnacle Gold Ribbon for Joel, because uh, he didn't have any balls. They're a lot more forgiving. Um, you know, it's not a female versus male thing or anything, but these are just a more forgiving ball. Where is Joel? He looks a little top heavy for a golfer, doesn't he? See, I'm more like a John Daly type. I would say Joel's probably more like a Davis Love III. Joel, where's Gizmo? She's running away that way. You may want to go get her. You she serious? won't stop. What? I told you I couldn't trust Joel with, uh, with Giz. He's used to those Rottweilers. He overcompensates. Where is she? She's like at the end of this fence, this big thing. Just let her go? She wouldn't stop. Where'd See she her? go? <clears throat> this is so ridiculous. All right, she got her workout. Yeah, she was just looking for me. She's scared of Joel. That would be. Pull out the big kahuna here. I always do. I always wanted to be one of those uh, long drive guys, you know, that has an extra long driver. They whip it way back and then whoo! Just like get all fired up. I always wanted to be one of those guys, but. Did you guys see that? Doing a mulligan. This is gonna be ugly. Can I borrow one of your balls? It's like Manute Bull trying to hit a ball. A pink ball, too. I haven't hit one in so long. Holy cow. Where'd it go? You got some power. It's in the it's in the water, but it's a good good ball. We're just learning how to drive, senior citizen school. We're playing three holes, Joel. If we don't play at least a multiple of three, that's gonna be a bad season. <laughs> yeah, he talks a lot. I'm surprised he bought brought Gizmo. I don't know, uh that goes really along with golf etiquette or not. Okay. Stay. Uh-uh. Stay. It'll be interesting. It's kind of back to basics, you know, kind of chasing. Like we used to back in the old days, we chase in Oklahoma all the time. Yeah. Have you seen the next two systems? Both the look one good. digs and the next one's like this <laughs> digs way down. I mean, I think the second half of May get a lot of intercepts, and the goal like. is to get the Dominator two into the tornado. We get the airborne drones in, and they're gonna work this time. And Dominator three can handle stronger tornadoes, and then we try to intercept with two tornadoes. So it's basically uh, gonna be a, a traffic jam. 
yeah. at the point of intercept. Hey, How's it going with everybody? It's a circus at the house. I mean, there's three dominators. The homeowners association that you didn't tell me about when you sold me the house is uh, going crazy. <laughs> I didn't know they'd be. Yeah, they're going nuts. I mean, uh, we've been chasing together way too long to, to not, I mean, 12 let's years. just get back to having fun again and doing that's, science. I think and, that's my big concern. It's sometimes you get all that other stuff involved and you know, it becomes more about that, it seems like, than it does actually the tornadoes and trying to get on good storms. Gizmo, stay. Come here, come to daddy. Well trained dog. Yeah. <clears throat> I thought it would, this year it was just gonna be me and Gizmo as chasing partners. I thought I wore everybody down, but. Yeah. Should we hit another yeah, round? Yeah, let's hit another one. Oh, well, let's, see. yeah. So here's the setup. Very unstable weather arrives tomorrow and just intensifies over the weekend. Significant outbreaks of severe weather do look likely. So there's an enhanced risk on Saturday in the orange. Large hail, damaging winds, and a few tornadoes around that is a slight risk. And on Sunday, an enhanced risk or moderate risk from central Oklahoma, including the entire metro through all of northern Oklahoma and then into northeastern Oklahoma as the late afternoon and evening hours push along. And then on Monday, Man, I thought you'd be outside like turning dials and tweaking knobs and stuff. And man, you're playing ping pong. Is no, that a stress not. reliever for F5s? <laughs> I can't get down. Not in good shape. Yeah. You want to join in? No, oh, no, I'm good. <laughs> wow, look at the side spin shot. Was that cyclonic or anticyclonic? <laughs> so what, what's what, what's the updates going on with the Dominator? What's happening? Two more camera angles. One that's on the uh, the real time one display. One looking the left side, one right, nice. one straight, and then a handheld too that I can. It's Velcro nice. that I can nice. point around. So okay. yeah, we'll be dialed in. Yeah. We have to awesome. be. Yeah. What are you thinking for Saturday, Sunday? Wow. You know, there's gonna be some six. There'll be still gonna be sixty knots on Sunday, five hundred. Oh yeah. Sixty knots. Yeah. And a little little jet too on Sunday was to have like. Uh, 50, 60, uh, 50 knots at uh, 850 yeah, or something? Yeah, it's big. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, it could be bad at OKC. Yeah. Oh. Well, I had to sleep. Okay. I'm in rambling uh, mode, so. All right. All right. Get some rest tomorrow. I will. I'll you know, probably. The Euro fire storms in Western Oklahoma tomorrow. There's not yeah. much flow. Yeah. Well, if, if it happens, 30 there, knots, yeah. look out. Yeah. So, I'll right. be out there. Like, See ya. There's no okay. use doing it yet, though. Do it now. We got to do it. The inflow's gonna believe. It's right above us! Look at the right leaves! <laughs> <laughs> the elliptical suction vortices! Right now we got a violent tornado!